Hello everybody, my name is Acrisius and welcome back to another Let's Play of Balloons Tower Defense Battles. I wasn't planning on making another video so soon. I hope you can hear it very I hope you can hear it well enough. I was watching my other one and I noticed my voice and the volume of the game were really clashing. You could barely hear me, but the game was really loud, so I have it turned down kind of low right now. Um the reason I'm doing another video is because we have this guy here. I got a free gold entry. I did this this morning. And I mentioned that I got a free gold entry because I was going to mention this story. This morning, I was half asleep and decided to play. I do that often. I'm usually not horrible when I do. Sometimes I lose, sometimes I win, but that's the game. But I did this without even realizing it was a gold one. I thought it was this one. I was barely paying attention. And I lost horribly. Because I didn't prepare for this specific thing. The gold entries, they all have something kind of special about them. This guy, both players receive the same random towers, double starting cash and double income. That's really good. If I didn't have this one coming up, I would definitely do this one. I love double income. I don't like random towers, but I like double income. Um, in a hurry, balloons can be sent. Two rounds earlier, all balloons are faster and income generates earlier. This is like one of the, this is kind of like the one I did yesterday, but not. Ignore that, that's my friend group and they're very odd. But this one is by far my favorite. Send balloons two rounds earlier. So it's like that other one. Faster income generation, just like the other one. Uh, the other one before the other one and then the reason I would do this my favorite Boost upgrade towers and balloons Now I went the entire match without realizing that any of these Were hap were happening. I thought it was a normal match even though I did think to myself at one moment. Hey um, For some reason Balloon! Oh god, please, no change out of interchange, please. I don't want to hit quit because I won't be able to do it again, but I really don't like interchange. Um. Maybe. Have pity. Uh, I guess I'll have to do it. He doesn't seem to be backing out. Oh, yep, he's wanting to stay. Um. The reason I don't like interchange so much is because. I guess we timed out and it just gave me a random tower. Okay, cool. Uh, and I don't even get my fourth tower. I'm probably gonna lose this. After bragging that this was my favorite. I just don't like interchange because you don't get that much space to put towers. I probably won't even use one of my airplanes. So it's not double income generation, it's just faster income generation. Which I'm fine with, I'm cool. I'm cool with that. Uh oh, I hate this one so much. If there was more room... Also, I was thinking about picking the, uh... About picking the, uh agent guy just for the income generation from him that's why I chose this guy though there's so little room inside but plenty of room outside and what the mega boosts do the whole reason I'm playing this is the mega boosts when you hit that instead of speeding your towers up it just upgrades them uh, to the next tier. So it would either give me Dragon's Breath or Summon Whirlwind. Uh, how it chooses, I believe, is random. If there's a way to make it do it. Like, the way I get it to do what I want it to do is... I'll show you. I don't want Dragon's Breath. Bam. I got Summon Whirlwind. Now I'll instantly get Tempest Tornado.
if I wanted the Phoenix, which is what you get after Dragon's Breath, I would have saved up and gotten a uh, Phoenix. his health if it kills his health cool I only launch them to get the income uh, boost especially now that I'm getting double income I need to save up some money and get lightning bolt if you rely too much these guys are cool the little uh, gatling guys but if you rely too much on them you will die especially if you go forget and forget about them, and then you go and, uh... Just upgrade another tower, he starts looking in the direction of that tower, and you become screwed. I might put up one plane. Yeah, I'm not sure. Just to have them. There we go. Oh. There we go. Now, I'll show you guys what I was talking about. I'll go ahead and waste one of these. Bam. Instantly, every single one is now stronger. So did he get never missed? No, he got a yeah, never missed targeting. He was crazy. Now, this guy got the lasers, which is really cool. I rarely ever uh, get the lasers because they cost so much. One good tower for this is the banana tower because you can start getting so much banana income because of this. But I'm about to start getting uh, the big balloons in here. So I'm going to start putting out other guys. Wave 23, I think it's wave 25. Let the big balloons start coming. Oh, I didn't even get to do my best thing. And I don't get to show you because I can't do a replay because I don't have any more gold membership. I got 40 keys, that's cool. But um, I put one of those in each corner and it's awesome. I always get them on Mega Boost because they're devastating. I'll do one more of uh, just the normal game because I can't do the golden games because the golden games cost money. If it's a one-time buy, though, I won't do it here, where y'all can see. But it, if, it, if it is a one-time buy, and I'll check that, I will go and do that because I'm not going to spending, be spending any of my own money. I have money saved up from their little... Um, oh, okay. It amounts to like a, it's a, a survey thing, and you get a little bit of money here and there for your surveys. Ooh, I like this one. 
I didn't skip the other map because I don't like the map. I skipped the other map because a lot of the time if it's a map I want and they skip it, I'll just randomly skip the next map no matter what it is out of spite. 16 seconds, okay. You, you, and you. Go ahead. Three. I gotta start off strong because I don't have any extra anything right now. But after this round, I will stop and see if the gold membership is a one-time thing. It's how I used to play the game, but now that I know about the, how the game works, it's a horrible thing to do. Using a bunch of towers instead of upgrading a few towers to where they're stronger is a horrible way to play it. Because he's got one, two, three, four, three, oh, well, now three towers. And if they're not upgraded all the way, I can actually go ahead and rip through him if I didn't have just these weak little guy balloons here. And I'm just sitting here pretty with my one guy. I'm not even planning on adding another guy quite yet. I will in a minute, but not quite yet. I'll do balloon adjustment for fun. Not really because I need to, just for fun. I'm just putting these guys out for the income. They're not horrible. But they're not the best standalone towers. And now I actually need to put something out, so I'll put something out here. Hmm. Here, I will not do my normal missile. I won't even touch twin guns. I want to do a reactor. And the reason I won't touch twin guns is because the reactor doesn't shoot anything, so I don't know if it's actually worth buying um, I don't know if it's worth buying anything on that tier because he doesn't actually uh, I can't think right now words are not coming to me in any meaningful manner but it doesn't actually shoot anything it just pops anything within its radius. Now it pops quite a bit in its radius, but it still only pops in its radius. Safety sake. I'll put this guy here. Start upgrading him to lightning bolt. I mean, it also lets everybody within the reactor uh, see any of the camo balloons. 
So camos are useless right now. For against him. If the shell can break, I might survive this. Nope, nope, not surviving, okay. <sighs> if you notice what I was criticizing him for doing earlier, I ended up doing. A bunch of towers wasted money because none of them were strong enough to actually do anything. Against that guy. If it wasn't for that, I would have kept going and I probably would have won. But I'm going to go ahead and end this here. And then I'm going to check and see if I can get the gold one. And if I can, I'll do two gold ones on another video within five hours and 22 minutes. All right, so until then, see ya.